World Wrestling Federation Tag Team Champions of the World, the Road Dog Jesse James, the Bad Billy Gunn, the New Age Outlaws. And if you don't like it, we got two words. If you don't like it, we got two words for you. Suck. Oh. Hey guys, it's LJ. Make sure you like the video and subscribe for more great contents from my daddy. Good afternoon, that damn 2K land, man. Check this out, man. So it all started with this tweet right here, and we just gonna money on the flow. Let's get straight to it, because sometimes you have to show. We got we to get a little, you know what I'm saying? You got to have a little happiness. Look at the little Chichi Wawa. I mean, all of these Chichi Wawa. Look at the Chichi Wawa. He's leading the horse. I ain't got a lot of it, man. Listen, man, I love these animals. I look, I sit on, on, uh, I sit on, on Twitter all day and scroll. And sometimes, man, I see these animal joints and y'all gonna see me liking these joints, man, because that's what I like to do, man. And we gonna talk about all that and more. Uh, and right now, y'all gonna see what I'm talking about in one second. But before we get started, make sure y'all like the video and comment y'all thoughts down below because y'all already know we're trying to go with this thing. To the moon, Alice! And if nobody told y'all this today, y'all, my brothers, my sisters, my family love each and every last one of y'all, man. Check this out, man. Hey. Uh, and y'all see what's going on in the background. It'll become apparent in one second. Hey, uh, this is what EJ says. Not gonna lie, the legend race in NBA 2K has not has not nearly it's not nearly as hyped as it used to be as it used to be in previous 2Ks. I remember when you could when you could get, uh, have 40 plus K viewers watching your rep, watching you rep up the legend. Now you're lucky if you get 1K viewers. And you're not lying about that, man. That's just how it is, man. Money on the floor. Let's get straight to it, man. It's just like like it's like I t I told people I said it. I was here when I said it. I was like, yo, we it, it, it's, it's going to be about a month, man. And then, you know, I, I hopefully the game lasts longer than that. But I just don't know if that's going to be the case. And we're talking about viewership and all that. People going to play the game all year. We're going to have fun all year. I enjoy the game. Everything is good. But I just think that the way that the game is right now as presently constructed uh you know it's gonna be it's gonna be something else man up next and we got the we got my man d now saying hey you haven't tweeted mike may mike uh at blue but you haven't tweeted the community in two weeks about your game man are you on vacation and they do say dude got fed up with dudes with a thousand games uh in a week complaining hey every year every year he disappears when the game comes out that's about right man they disappear when the game come out he come back a couple of uh couple of weeks later or whatever and stuff like that man so you know it is what it is we just see how that goes man up next hey we just say hey why can i get why can why is it that i can get post spin this is what uh gb3 says why can i get post spin and drop steps when i have 99 interior and 99 strength with uh with legend post lock all against gold and hall of fame post badges and he says hey why even remove the ability to pull the chair why remove the ability to pull the chair and double h just came through man and he just says hey i've been trying to say this for years now that strength height wingspan and other play um, of other players is irrelevant when guarding the post score they still get the same animation they do all i mean they do on any uh on anyone else because drop stepping and post spinning are broken gameplay mechanics and they I mean, and that uh, that has not been addressed. They haven't been addressed, man. You know, this is how it go, man. We know stuff hasn't been addressed. We know, we know what goes on, man. We just know how it goes. Up next, hey man, he said this is me on my point guard with no driving dunk, trying to throw a self alley, man. You see that thing, Kuzma? You know we got to get it up out of there quickly because you know how the, you know how them boys go and 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 up to the topic at hand and what's going on in the community and all this stuff, man. This is what my boy Splashy said, man. This is my guy Splash, man. Splash, we need to get together and do something, man, because listen, I'm just gonna tell you right this. Searching for 25 minutes and counting, try walking out as well. This is why skill-based matchmaking is complete and utter dog shit. And look, look at where I am. I'm just in 3v3, in, in, in 3v3, uh, no squads, 3v3. I've been in here for at least 10 minutes. I've not been able to get a game yet. We've been sitting here just waiting. I've left, come back. Other people left and came back. This is the same thing, man. And this is why J.A. Bridge for says, hey, man, skill-based matchmaking needs to be removed ASAP. There is no reason that anyone should have to wait 30 minutes to get a game in any game mode on 2K. And you're absolutely correct, especially when y'all are boasting 10, 10 million players and all that stuff right there, man. Like, why am I? I'm I'm sitting. This is live, bro. I am right here. I'm in. I'm playing 2K. Look, I'm going to hit the button and say I'm playing 2K. I am right now playing 2K. I'm not playing something else. I'm not doing anything else. I am playing NBA 2K right now. This is not screenshotted. This is nothing else. This is me waiting in the queue 
for 25 minutes and this video probably gonna be like 20 minutes and i'm still gonna be in the damn queue man like what's going on Mike? What, what's going on man tell me what's going on hey but look though flash this said hey do y'all think that the grades on your customs matter this year yes they do matter they matter a great deal the biggest thing is going to be time and stability and probably defensive immunity the jump shot height really don't matter the speed definitely matters because you know that that goes without saying because of speed but defensive immunity definitely matters especially if you're going to use the shot stick and also the uh what's the other one defensive immunity and like i said time and stability i had one that was time and stability and the time and stability was bad couldn't hit anything time and stability good i can hit a lot and especially with the rhythm stick so uh that's what i think splashy let me know what you think uh what you think right <laughs> right there and then dude said and then he came back and said dude said that i'm running trying to beat up on bombs you see dude just left you see one dude just left right all right we just said said say I'm, I'm running trying to beat up on scrubs uh for one double rep dude's brain's really the size of an airpod dot dang boy. damn 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 that's how it is man shit that's how you feel right there. Hey, that's how I feel, Splash. I feel the same way too, man, because again, I'm sitting in queue right now. This is live. Y'all see what time it is. Right now, it's 548. My time is 548 right there. You see dude left? Let's see if we gonna get a game, man. We gonna see if we gonna get a game, man. Up next, hey, bro, why y'all do this every year talking about the, uh, the previous 2K was smoother, bro? There's absolutely no way that y'all believe that NBA 2K 20 was smoother than 25, man. If you want to talk about that you could dribble and do stuff like that and then that ridiculous, ridiculous, that ridiculous ass step back, that step back got to go out this game. But bro, that step back will drop you almost every time and all that. But if y'all trying to tell me that 20 is smoother than this, this, you see what it say up there on the screen? That's why y'all believe that this game was better because the viewership was at its all time high because of that word right there. That's what it is. It ain't nothing else, bro. We were all locked in, so we were locked in. Wow, we were locked in, man. That's why I said, except for me, I couldn't really be locked in. Why can't I be locked in? Because I am an essential worker. And, it, and when if computer systems go down and networks go down, guess what go down? Everything goes down and then, you know, stuff like that. So we already know what it is, man. But yeah, 2K20 was a good game. I enjoyed it. It was not better than 25. It was not smoother than 25. None of that, none of that was the case. But hey, Bronny James four years ago, look at him get that dub for Aiden and send Aiden into stardom man hey man it is hey that's just how it goes man but yeah uh 2k 20 smoother than 25 i don't think anybody believes that bro uh let's see what let's see what people say uh of course they're gonna say yep yeah, 20 better than 25 20 was 20 was nice i ain't gonna lie but new gen got the edge in graphics and smoothness 2k 20 is is much better okay get out of here man don't disrespect 2k 20 like that now 25 is smoother in my opinion i agree calling 2k 20 smooth is actually insane i swear i swear i'm the only one uh am i the only one who remembers how bad the game exactly bro like we always think that the, that the last relationship was better than the current relationship but it's only because that as humans we are we are designed to not remember the bad things you don't remember that you almost didn't make it to the side of a swimming pool so that you will want to go swimming another, you know another day we will decide to forget the things that were bad so like we will continue to want to do things but that's just how it go man here we go he said hey the only people who are happy with skill-based matchmaking in every mode are the people who suck at the game i'm not gonna lie to you i do enjoy playing people on my level i'm trying to get better at the game though that's what i'm trying to do i'm trying to get better at the game that's what i'm trying to do is that skill-based matchmaking is good for random wreck but that's about it i definitely agree with that and uh and that's what it is say hey, yep that's yeah that's the point of it right and that's what i said when people say i didn't even know the skill-based matchmaking was in the game that's the point you're not supposed to notice that it's in the game if it's if it's properly done you will just think that you've gotten better or, or that you're getting better or because you're playing against people on your level and so you're gonna naturally win more games because you're playing against people on your level and when you hop up a tier you're gonna get that ass taxed and then you're gonna get knocked back down and you start back winning again so it's the constant thing of i'm getting better oh did i get better no oh yeah i did get better so like that's what it's doing so it's doing its job that's what it should be but like they said man some people are saying skill-based matchmaking should only be improving grounds and they say that's who it's for and i don't have an issue with it that's how gaming is now it is fair i ain't gonna say it's fair man because like i shouldn't have to sit here and play against against stuff like this I don't care who I play against. You can put you can put Bear out there. I don't care who I'm playing against. I accept the challenge. But this right here is unacceptable. I have been in the queue for as long as this video. We nine minutes into the video. I was in here nine minutes before, so it's 20 minutes in there. Hey, this is how I feel right here, man. Uh, I green. <laughs> I 
Zachary three in a row and heard, let him shoot. They're gonna make him miss. But why are people looking like this, man, bro? It's not like that, bro. You can hit several in a row. You can do stuff like this. You just gotta use the shot stick, man. And that's why that boy splashy. And hey, he put this up there, man. So, hold on, I probably can't put this up. I probably can't put that up there like that, kind of, because you know it's the boondocks, and they're gonna say, they say, hey, look, this is how I feel when I see people having fun with the shot stick. Hey, you wanna slap them, man. But listen, Spillboy told y'all, man, he said, listen, you should use the shot stick, and this is why. What if I told you that rhythm shooting, a uh, rhythm shooting green window was 70% larger compared to using the button? And then uh, uh, Chalk says, my issue with it is that I'm, it severely punishes guards. Slower jump shots, uh, slower jump shots, it is, it is so, Oh, on slower jump shots, it's so easy to use the rhythm shooting. On fast jump shots, it's nearly impossible. Really hurts guards in competitive play. Let me tell you what he said. I agree with I agree with this, but maybe but maybe not severely. Button shooters, button shooting is still solid, and 70% increase is uh, only if you have two perfect timings. I'm gonna tell you this right here though. The problem with the stick is sometimes the stick will completely misfire, and you'll pull it down, and you'll try to shoot it and then you'll flick it up and you'll be like dang slightly early i mean very early very late and guess what happened it didn't go off so it's, it's it's a lot of give and take when you use that shot stick man it's not guaranteed like we had we played a game the other night i had a game winner i had a game winner had to shoot it on the line i shot the game winner and walked off because i knew i hit the shot but i couldn't shoot i couldn't trust the stick because i knew that it may misfire at that point and make me just hold the ball i've tried to remedy this by putting putting my um putting my shot pro stick on just shooting no dribbling moves but it hadn't completely resolved the issue man that's something that we got to look into you can't shoot the ball immediately once once it is and it was just like that with the other shot stick too so we'll see how that goes anyway up next uh like job is for he says why is the green window bigger when you're using the shot stick man and you know they're telling you how to do it with the perfect time and it's key or what have you but this is what they're that's what they're telling you you know if you if you Get the push timing right, you're gonna have a much wide margin, margin of error. I think they said, you know, it's about 50 milliseconds on one, it's about 100 and some odd milliseconds on the other one that you can use and get very good timing. So I think that that they're saying that using the stick, uh, you know, using the stick is gonna be, it's gonna be crazy. So this is a green, this is what happens to the green window when you're using the button. And you've got from, you can, you can hit a green from 55 to 120 seconds, but the main, you know, the make window, the main make window is in here. It's gonna be about about uh, 25 milliseconds or something like this, but this is about 50, what's that, it's like 70 milliseconds or something like that, right? And then, as it goes on, with perfect timing in the middle edges, you know, you see a make, right? So you go, uh, even if when you green, you're gonna hit about 60% with the button. So even when you're greening, you, you, you can, you're gonna miss sometimes, but when you're using that, this is the green windows, about 69 milliseconds is what they're saying. It's pretty big with all things considered. But the make percentage is about 75%. 75% with perfect timing is absolutely insane. As hard as it is to shoot in this game, RNG should not be taking me down still. But hey, it is what it is. Say, so, you know, all right, now. Now, we're gonna take a look at what they're saying. Take a, take a rhythm shooting. The, the green window the green window for the for you know you got so they say you go from from about 69 milliseconds to 120 milliseconds so it's almost double and and so your green window is 70 percent larger but the make percentage are closer to 80 percent so it's 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 crazy that that that's the case but i've known this since the beginning like they said now they're gonna put these two windows on one side and you see when you're shooting with the button you are putting yourself at a severe disadvantage you can make it from here to here so the green window is much larger almost as twice it's almost twice as big uh, when you're doing that what i would do is what i would do is i would just try it if you out there bricking bro you might as well give it a shot man because look at this like this right here is just it's, it's not minuscule it's tremendous rhythm shooting green window perfect time and release versus the button and like like you go from like you said you go from about 65 milliseconds to a make window of about uh, about a 120 or something like that and and then we're talking about us in a significant window from from here to here a significant window from 40 percent of above from you know that's almost 100 milliseconds that you got you got about 95 milliseconds so it is much larger but at the same time it is what it is it's so 
It's so much so that Black Cobra said, listen, man, I'm going to lock myself into this sweat room and I'm going to force myself to use the rhythm stick until I, you know, until I get it down on Hall of Fame, man. And that's what you're going to have to do. You really, the best place to learn how to rhythm shoot is really going to be to go to the, uh, go to, go play in the, um, my career and just get used to it and i'll do an advanced tutorial on how to use the rhythm stick uh for real and then so so power came in he's he's slightly wrong here but he's not all the way wrong he says so let me put it another way if you choose to shoot with the button your green window is being reduced by 70 percent this year if uh is that really fair and so he's not saying that it's it's not a 70 percent reduction you just don't get the 70 percent boost right like like it's like if i have if I get a bonus at the job, everybody, because I did a great job or I did something else, I used this, I got a bonus. You didn't get a reduction, I just got a bonus. So you got to keep what you get, you keep you get to keep your salary or whatever you got, but I just got a bonus. So that, that's, that's all it is, it's like, I mean, a bonus is in addition to, it's something earned in addition to compensation that would normally have been received. So this is a bonus. You're gonna get the bon you get the 60 millisecond, but you get a bonus green window of about of about whatever right there. And this billboard says, hey, you got a time two inputs instead of one. I don't see it as unfair. Uh it's a challenge. And if you it's a challenge, and if you time it correctly, you are rewarded. The 70% increase scenario is if you have perfect push timing. And so he says, uh he'll say we'll have to we'll have to dis disagree on that. That's nothing to disagree on, Powell. Um you can't disagree. It's a bonus. It's not a it's not a reduction. If I make more money than you, I went to school, I make more money. You didn't get a reduction in your pay. I just got an increase. You understand what I'm saying? So you're doing something different. So it's more beneficial to do this, just like it's more beneficial to be a doctor than it is to be a lowly IT guy like I am. Because a doctor makes like two, three hundred thousand dollars a year. That doesn't mean that I got a 50% reduction in my, in my salary. It just means that they got more because they're doing something different and they're doing more. So, I mean, I think it is what it is, man. But he says, hey, we'll have to disagree on that. No shooting method should be, should give you a 70% uh, boost. Timing two inputs might might add some challenge, but such a massive, uh, but but such a massive advance in is unbalanced. Uh, it's not about skill anymore. It's about exploiting the mechanic. Now nah, it's about skill because I done seen people go out there and straight smoke them joints, bro. So it is what it is. Bro, I don't know what y'all boys doing right there, man. But hey, uh, it, it's speaking of exploring mechanics, bro, because y'all, I mean, like, like exploring the mechanic, like, you know, playing with 60 overall so you can make sure you win the thing. Hey, anyway, and you can always go this route right here, man, because this guy right here says, hey, man, this is the first video I've seen of the rhythm shooting script. The rhythm shooting script is out there. And man, look, look, bro. That's absolutely insane. He's shooting with the button, or he just touched the stick, pause, and then it, it shot, it shoots it for you. So, and look at what he's on, PlayStation. He's on PlayStation. So if you're gonna sit there and say, <laughs> it's not on PlayStation, it's on the Xbox. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. I told y'all that people are sitting here doing remote play and all that stuff, and they doing everything that they possibly can in order to cheat. He's on PlayStation with it. So just, Take it, do with it what you will, suck it, whatever you do. If, if, if you, if, you know what I'm saying? Hey, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of our ladies, D-Generation X proudly presents to you the World Wrestling Federation Tag Team Champions of the World, the Road Dog Jesse James, the badass Billy Gunn, the New Age Outlaws. And if you don't like it, we got two words. If you don't like it, we got two words for you. Suck it all up. Fuck it! Yeah, that's what we that's what you do, man. I don't ain't nobody trying to hear that stuff, man. Y'all keep trying to paint this narrative that only Xbox people got access to this this technology when we've shown y'all that people have access to it. Anyway, Lil Sean, man, is showing y'all, man, listen, bro. You can get busy out there. You can really get busy out there. Because people talking about you can't move and you can move, man. Look at ooh, ooh, oh, oh my god. Sean, I'm following you, Sean. Sean, I'm following you. Let me come play some lock for you. That's what I'm talking about. And she can play center. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh my God. Look, I'm not, I'm not going for none of that right there. Trays up, splash down. Man, this man out here moving like this, man. And people talking about like we need a shooting boost or a movement boost. We I think we just gotta figure it out, man. And then last but not least, Hoodie Kai with some with some excellence right here, man. Look at this right here, man. This man say, hey, look, he said once, oh, I'm, I'm back. I've got the, he said, I got the full game. I got the full version of the game. Now, Trey Ball. 
Bang, bang. That's what it is. Hey, tray ball. Bang, bang. Let me see if we can get that bang, bang back going. Okay, we didn't get the bang, bang back going. Bang, bang. Bang, bang. There we go right there, man. So it is what it is, man. Hey, he out there hooping, man. Let's go to the next video that he said, man. Because he said he has unlocked the full version of the game, man. And this is what this is what I'm talking about, man. This is what I like. I like to see people take those challenges on, man, and say I'm about to do what I'm about to do and break a heart. No, I love the girl. I know that the best thing is for us to be apart. Check it out, man. Look, y'all think I'm BSing, man. Check it out. Look. I'm in here. I can't get out of here, bro. I'm, I'm, I'm in here right now. I've been in this lobby the entirety of this video and nobody should be punished like this. I've done absolutely nothing, bro. And I can't get a game and I'm only gold status. So I'm only, I can only imagine what somebody like Splashy is going through who is red, red card. Now I'm a red card on my other player. So maybe that's got something to do with it and all of that. But absolute, this is what we need to be worried about. We don't need to be worried about no 70%. 70% boost from the shot stick because people are still completing other dog shit with it. So we don't have to worry about that. People scared to use it. It's not overpowered. You have to time two inputs. You got to do all this stuff, man. Look, I'm trapped in here. I can't get out of here. And if I were to quit, the pro I would probably incur a 30 minute ban or something. So I have no choice other than to sit here and wait for it to assign me an opponent. And this is absolutely irrefutable evidence that this is the skill-based matchmaking is bad. Just, just because I'm decent at the game. I ain't even good at the game. Like, I, I you know, playoffs, I just want to play a game. That's all I want to do is play a game. I can't rep up because I'm too good at the game. And, it, and the truth of the matter is I'm ass. So what's going on, man? Anyway, I don't know what's going on. I'm going to show y'all one more time, bro. I, let's, let's see. If I were to quit this game, we're going to see what happens. I quit the game. I'm about to go back in. And we will see if they're going to try to ban me or something like that, man, because there's absolutely no reason that I should have been sitting there. We in we 20, I've been in queue literally 30 minutes. I was on, I was on, uh, right, right here. My, my, uh, what's, what's this thing right here, bro? It says this right here. Look, I'm, I'm recording this joint, bro. I'm recording. I think y'all can see it. I'm gonna rent it all the way back. It says 26 minutes, right? 26 minutes, but I was in here before that. Look, I've been in here. I've been in here. I've been in here. Look at that, man. 26 minutes. Oh, I'm on the wrong screen. Ain't a boom. Here we go right here. Look, 26 minutes, 27 minutes, bro. I've been in here. I ain't been doing nothing else but being in here for 27 minutes. That is absolutely insane that I've been in here for 27 minutes and I've not been allowed to play the game on my 3 and D guard. All I want to do is go in the theater and play, play, and uh, play three of you three randoms and do hood rat shit with my friends and y'all won't let me do it. This is something to get upset about. My rep, I want to get my cap breakers. I'm close to my cap breakers. I could probably go to the wreck and get a game. I don't want to play wreck. I want to play theater. I can definitely go to the park and get a game, but I ain't got but a little bit of time, bruh. So like this thing is really punishing me for being a little bit, I'm marginally better than the next person and, and I can't get a game. This is absolutely insane. Waiting for opponent. I wonder how long these three guys have been here. But right now, it's already too long. If it's three of us right here in the lobby, it's already been too long, man. It's already been too long. It should be saying, waiting for opponent, game on right now. That's what it should be saying. And, uh, but, but guess what? I'm still sitting here. I think I'm, I'm, I'm gonna do the video out and I will let y'all know exactly how long it has taken me. But this is already too long. I already been in here for 30 minutes just trying to get one game and I can't get a game. That's absolutely unacceptable, man. But y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section, man. Hit the like button and let's share the video so Mike them can understand how bad the skill-based matchmaking is in this game. Right here, I got a 92 overall. I got a 99 overall to a 95. It's trying to help me, but we can't get a game, bro. And it ain't nothing wrong with the game right now because other people is playing in theater. It's just, it is what it is. Let me know what y'all think down in the comment section. Hit y'all, hit the subscribe button if you're new. I'll holler at y'all next time. Till next time. It's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ. Gosh, baby, gosh, baby.